How can I easily exchange variables between Codesys 2.3 and eCockpit using Modbus? Here we've got a PFC100 which is programmed in eCockpit and a 750-880 which is programmed in Codesys 2.3. I've already declared some variables, so rtemp and wcount which are at flag addresses, so mw0 for the real variable and mw2 for the word. Since the real variable is taken up two words, we need to skip one address here, so mw1 is also occupied by the real variable. Since we want to read the w count, we just increase it by one each cycle, and we want to write the rtemp variable from our eCockpit application, we just display it. Going back to eCockpit, we now can go to the product catalog and select the 750, 880 and put it into our network view. This is only a Modbus slave, so it cannot be programmed using eCockpit. Of course, we need to set the address, which is in my case the 1.80. And then we can define the variables, which we have defined in Codices 2.3. So we just double click the controller and you can see in the Modbus slave tab here, we've got the PLC variables. Doing the right click and clicking add, we'll bring up a data point, which we can name with any name we want, but I will use the names I also used in Codices 2.3. So rtemp, which is located at MW0 and data type is real. And then the second variable, is w count which is located at mw2 and data type is word you can see that the modbus addresses are set automatically so going back to the network view we can now draw the connection from the master to the slave and configure this connection by going into the modbus configurator in the available data points, we can see our two variables which we just defined in the Modbus slave and we can publish them. Those are now from the access type write only, but we want to read the w count variable, so we set it to read only instead. Now the configuration is already done and we can go to our program structure to use the variables. Here we already get the Modbus global variable list which we can use. So we can type in modbus dot the name of the controller and then the variable rtem. We want to write this variable and I wanted to set it to 1% of the count variable. So we just do 0 0.01 times and then we need to do a conversion to real. And then we use modbus and then again the name of the controller and the variable w count. And now our configuration is already done. So we can connect to our controller and then start the application. And we can do the same in Codesys 2.3. So online login and then online run and the application is running. And you can see the count variable is being increased and the rtemp variable is always 1% of the value of the count variable.